Hi. Lately I've been playing lots of Fender Shaman and Dual Shaman amps. You know, that's the head version of the, the Twin Reverb. Uh, I'm still aiming at the Marshall Tone or the vintage 70s Marshall Tone. Uh, but I, 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 I've come to believe that, that, that most of that tone comes from uh, uh, the cabs, you know, the Pulsonic Greenbacks and the 4x12 construction Mar Marshall cabs. And that Marshall amps perhaps were, were more influential in the eight, early 80s for that tone. And, but I'm not sure, so, so, so I have to do as many investigations as I can just to see what, what, what amps I'm, I'm going to use. Because yeah, this, this, this uh, especially the, uh, the, the 70s Silverface showman, dual showmans, really promising and, and actually an enormous bang for the buck especially com compared to the Marshalls. So I'm going to compare a 1975 uh, Fender Dual Showman head here to a 1971 uh, Marshall Superlead. Uh, this one has been modded, uh, so, so, so the, the uh, cathode uh, of, of the first preamp tube is not splitted as, as, usually, as they usually are in, in, in Superleads. They're joined like, like the Superbases and there's no bright gap. Otherwise, it's a super lead. Uh, I'm going to compare that to, to, the, uh, to the Fender. Uh, and you can see the, uh, uh, the settings here. I'm trying to, to make them sound basically as bright and tight, both of them. Uh, so a little bit more gain on, on the Fender than the Marshall. Uh, to, to get the same kind of hard rock slash rock and roll tone. Uh, I'm also going to use two guitars here on, on the Fender amps. Because I, just something I wanted to try myself. I'm going to play the uh, uh, dual showman with both uh, a standard and a custom, uh, but, but the uh, Marshall just with the custom. Uh, you can see all specs in the video description. All right, let me know what you think. Cheers. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.